Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Kendra and today I have a Dollar Tree grocery haul. Okay, so Lemonade Mom over here on YouTube does Dollar Tree hauls and I love them. They're one of my favorite things to watch and because I've watched her, I've watched like several other people here on YouTube do it. So today I went into Dollar Tree. Um, we've had a Dollar Tree in our town for maybe a year, maybe a little over a year. It opened during the pandemic, um, towards the beginning of it. But anyways, I was super excited. I kind of went in there with an idea of what I wanted to get. Our Dollar Tree truck came in yesterday and they didn't have a ton of the things that I was thinking they would have, but they did have some neat stuff. So I'm just gonna show you what I got. It's not my best haul, but I'm excited with the purchases I did get. So anyways, starting with Stacy's Pita Chips. These are the cinnamon sugar ones. We love these. I'm going to make a cream cheese dip to go with these. And I got four of these for an after school snack. You can buy the big packs of these at Sam's Club, but a great Dollar Tree purchase. And then I also got Stacy's pita chips, garlic and herbs. I've never tried these ones, but they're really good. There's quite a few ingredients, yeah. Not as healthy as they seem to look. All right, now Atticus has became a talkie, talkies? I don't know how to say that person. He is eating these like every chance he gets to go to the store, he's picking these up. So I got him two packs of these. Um, hot chili pepper and lime. But all I know is these things stain his fingers. He, his fingers are a different shade of red. And I'm like, what did you do? And he's like, I'm eating Takis. <laughs> and I think my other kiddos like them too. So I don't know, are these the new thing? Is this what everybody's into? So got two of those. Harlow needed some more hand sanitizer for gymnastics. So I just got this small Purell. It'll fit right into her front pocket for her uh, gymnastics bag. Uh, her gymnastics is probably got about a month left. So this will be plenty. I got some decorative shred, two or three of these, th three of them. Um, we are doing Mayday baskets this weekend and I thought we would go with putting this with some candy in it, but then I went to Walmart and I thought I've seen where people do popcorn and jelly beans or popcorn and Skittles. So I think we're going to do that route this year. Um, we may have some leftovers where we use this stuff, but so I'll just keep this around. We'll use it for something I'm sure, or just keep it around for next year, Easter baskets or Mayday baskets. But I think the Dollar Tree always has these in stock over by the gift section, um, right underneath the gift bags. I've always seen a selection of these and no, I thought they were cute. It's purple or not purple, blue and pink. I don't know if you can see the color. So got three of those. And then journals. So my girls love to journal. They are always trying to find paper and journals. They, anytime they have their own money, they're doing that. So I got this unicorn book. It has lines. I think this will probably be for Harlow. How cute, he glistens. Then this one is mermaid. You know, I'm not sure. I think A would probably like this one. So, and it glistens too. And then tie-dye, Sparrow will love this. Sparrow's really into tie-dye right now. So, and it's same. And then Story, she loves these colors. And she actually has a t-shirt that almost matches this. So she is sure to love this one too. But I just like these cheap um, books. I may put these back for our trip to Colorado this summer. Um, it's the beginning of the summer, just so that they have something new. I was thinking about putting like a little pack of new things with, you know, some pencils and stuff so that they can have it on their drive and while we're there in our cabin. So I think I might do that. That sounds like a really good idea. So just giving them to them today. I'll put these back and slowly um, make a little happy box or happy bag or something to, uh, to give them something to do while we're on our way and that's the cabin. Okay. Sour Patch Freezer Bars. So Lemonade Mom got these and I was like, ooh, that, sour is no longer my thing. I think I liked sour when I was younger, but 
Um, I know my kids love Sour Patch, so I knew I had to get these. I was super excited that our Dollar Tree actually had them. So I got, it's a 10 pack. Yep, 10 pack. I'll put those in the freezer. I'm sure this weekend it's supposed to be warm, so we'll probably eat these up. And then I got the Skittles one. They have orange, strawberry, green apple, and grape, 10 of them. So I've never seen these until Lemonade Mom put them on there. Have you guys? We just typically get the Walmart, I don't know, it's in the bag. So I think the kids will like those. Those will be a fun treat for this weekend. And then I got two of these Betty Crocker Easy Seal storage containers. See, they're rounded. I have been wanting to do overnight oats. Um, for a while and I I just have bigger containers that we're a big family and so I wanted some smaller containers and I thought for one dollar three for a dollar I mean that's a good deal and Betty Crocker I think that's a good brand but anyways so I got two of those I hope to start making overnight oats this weekend I'll probably do some prepping on Sunday so anyways I think that is it, that is everything. It was a small haul, but I am sure as I just pay a little more attention to what's there, um, I only like to buy things that are a necessity. I don't wanna just buy stuff to buy stuff. Um, but I do like the Dollar Tree. I, It's a newer thing around here and I'm loving it. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you have not subscribed, please do. And we'll see you next time, bye.